there would be no fans allowed in as CSUF hosts CSUN in the first round of the Big West Conference Tournament. Early on, CSUN with the lead, Jordan Jackson drives in and sinks the floater to give the Matadors the 12-6 lead. Early in the second quarter, Reina Perez finds Taylor Turney as she splashes the open three to cut the deficit to two. Now in the third, Reina Perez showing everyone why she was the Big West Player of the Year as she shakes the defender and drains the three to extend the Titans' lead to 14. In the fourth, with the Titans up big, Perez showing she can do it all as she gets another assist to Turney as the Titans would go on to defeat CSUN by a score of 67 to 52. Very well, you know, it would have been really easy to be disappointed that we had a chance to lock up the number two seed at home uh, the last game of the regular season. Didn't get the job done, uh, but, you know, like I told them after the game of the locker room, we're a young team, we're learning how to win big games. So. I think I just put a big emphasis on we, not me. So, um, honestly, I was just looking for my teammates. When I'm not there, I know they'll pick me up, regardless if my shot's falling or not. But. Um, no, it's huge that I impact the game, doing other things, assist, rebounding. But like you said, it wasn't falling at the beginning. Got it a little bit towards the second half, but I'm just happy my teammates were there to pick me up, honestly. In front of an empty gym, the Titans would defeat CSUN and move on in the Big West Conference Tournament. The Big West Conference Player of the Year, Reyna Perez, would record a double-double with 14 points and 11 assists. The Titans will be back here at Walter Pyramid tomorrow night as they take on the Hawaii Rainbow Wahine at 8.30 p.m. From Walter Pyramid, I'm Kyle Fulbright, Titan Sports.